everyone and welcome back to my channel so today I will be taking my photos by myself for my virtual commencement I'm actually graduating in architecture I got my master's and I'm very excited because this was such a long process this took me a little bit over five years it was an accelerated master's uh, program I'll be taking you guys on this journey and I'm a little nervous especially because none of us are used to this whole virtual commencement thing that's going on but thanks to coronavirus we all have to adapt to this new normal so I'll be taking you guys on my my journey to that and so let's get to it I have about five hours to take my photos it is due actually at 6 p.m. and I don't know I think it's 1 p.m. right now yeah so let's do it let's go <laughs> okay so I already blow dried my hair with my hot tools blowout brush I actually have a video down below if you guys want to watch it um, so basically that's how I get my little waves and curls with that blowout brush. It's similar to the Revlon brush. And so my hair is done and now I will start with my makeup. Let's do it. I'm looking for a very simple makeup look but something really nice. I am not that great at doing makeup but I'll make it work. So I'm done with my makeup. I just did something real quick and real simple. I actually, I don't think too much about my makeup. I just make sure I look even and toned. And yeah, that's about it. And so now I think we can start the process of taking the photos. I actually have my cap and gown steamed and ready. I steamed it myself with my hand steamer. And let me go show you. Okay, so I placed my gown on top of my door in order to be able to steam it. That's the only way I was able to do it because it is so long. And so the only pieces that are missing are my cap and this is the hood. It basically wraps over my shoulders and onto my back. That's where it drops. And that's what you wear for your master's degree. So now I have my setup done. So I'll be using two tripods, one for my actual phone and one for vlogging to show you guys the steps and the process that I'm going through. So. The tripod that will have my phone on it, I'll have a little clicker to take my pictures. And so let me show you my setup. So this is the tripod for my phone, as you see here. And this is the tripod for vlogging to show you guys how this whole step will go. I have my cap and gown with me on hand and I will be putting it on. And so as you can tell, I'm wearing a regular top and jeans. Because why wear a dress if nobody's going to see it? Alright guys, this is so weird. So basically there's a button that attaches the, um, the stole. So there's a button inside here, but every time I attach it, there's this gap. So I think I need to go get a safety pin. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and I just put a safety pin onto the shirt I'm wearing underneath to about right here with the string. And it worked out. I think it's fine. There's no gap. And I don't know what's happening in the back, but I think it looks... Okay, yeah, I'm excited. Okay, so now I don't know if I want to wear this, but I think I go under. Okay, there we go. Yeah, actually, okay, I'm not wearing this until the actual commencement date because it is covering the FIU tag that I'm very proud of and I don't want to cover that. So yeah, this could just stay there. 
This is so complicated, I can't. Okay, this is showing again now. Okay, we got the whole back. Okay, pull the shirt down, this comes down. Okay, there we go. And I want to show the FIU sign. Okay. It's great, okay. And now I have my cap. I wish I could have actually decorated it, but it's okay because I think we will be having an actual commencement date to be able to walk after this whole pandemic is over. I'm just hoping. And so maybe that'll be when it actually gets decorated. Done. Okay, so I think I took like a thousand pictures, so um, I'm gonna have like such a tough time picking one. I don't know why I did that, because I think half of them look the same, so it's gonna be a tough one for me. Okay, so I have finally taken everything off, and that was extreme because I am sweating. Now I will start editing and I have approximately two hours to submit everything. Um, so it's just an image and a description of what I want to be displayed on the slide when my picture comes up. And so the graduation date is May 8th, I believe, and today is the 28th of April, so today is just a photo day. And I will keep you guys updated on how the virtual commencement goes and what it's like, so yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day guys. Love you. Bye.